That's not how I say it either. That sounds like I'm spoiled. <laughs> I look so strange with the center parting. I know. Hello everyone, welcome back to my channel. This is now the fifth time I am recording this video and I am annoyed because this is the fifth time I'm recording this video but you gotta do what you gotta do. I am gonna film a clothing haul, that's the whole point because I've been shopping a hell lot and I have a lot of things to show you so let's get into it. I had a better intro last time but because I'm so annoyed I'm not gonna bother this time. This is the intro that you're gonna get. I'm gonna start off the haul with Forever 21. I placed an order on the Canadian site and my brother very kindly carried all the clothes for me. I bought a lot of uh, plain basic items. Why am I telling this to you? The haul is pretty self-explanatory. Let's get started. The first shirt that I picked up was this plain white, plain white, plain blue top and it is a cotton fitted top and I love cotton fitted tops because you can wear that with anything. You can wear that with a skirt, you can wear that with shorts, you can wear that with jeans, you can wear that with tights. You can wear a fitted cotton shirt with anything. I don't have a fitted shirt in this color so I picked it up and I don't have anything else to say so let's move on to the next item. The next item I picked up was this striped top and this is a I don't think this is a cotton material it's like that t-shirty stretchy material I don't really know what that kind of material is let's check what this material really really is it's a knit top oh wow it's knit not so sure how I'll style this in the summer but I'm gonna make it work because I really like tops like these the next item is a little different from something that I usually wear and uh, not it's a striped top so I like striped tops but the fit of the top is really different and because it's so loose and baggy and so boxy, I usually steer clear of really boxy uh, clothing bits because they tend to drown me. I'm quite petite and if I wear like a really boxy top, it looks like the top is wearing me. So this would be interesting. I thought I'd pair this with skinny jeans and like nerdy glasses and make it look really cute. So yeah, we'll see. You'll probably see what it looks like on when I try it in the snippet that you are going to see because this is the try on haul. Next thing that I picked up is the perfect clothing item for the summer. Now, I don't know why I did not think about this sooner, but I was looking for something that wasn't gonna make me hot on my legs. I love wearing skinny jeans, but they're not the most comfortable piece of clothing item that you could wear during the summer especially where I live it gets really hot so I was like okay what is something that's gonna cover my legs and not make me too hot and it just popped into my head like a bulb a jumpsuit so I picked up a jumpsuit this is the jumpsuit that I picked up it's so me like it's really really floral and the best thing about this jumpsuit is it fits me it's an extra small I think if you are wondering yeah this is an extra small and the legs fit me it has elastic on the body so it doesn't drown me like it cinches in i look super flattering and i was thinking of pairing it with a pale dusty pink colored t-shirt and this on top with some converse or like a white shirt inside or a black shirt could a black shirt work no okay a white shirt or a pale pink shirt and it's so soft and i'm so excited to wear this and i am excited next uh, clothing pieces I picked up from Forever 21 were trousers and I love the trousers but the sad thing is they don't fit me. They're an extra small but they don't fit me so I'm gonna have to get some work done on them so they can fit me but the first pair looks like it's a plazo pant and it's really bell bottomy like it's super bell bottomy and uh, it doesn't fit me from the waist so I'm gonna have to get it tailored from the waist also from uh, the leg because I'm super short and this literally drowns me. I like the zip detailing at the back. I think once it's my size, it's gonna look really good. The next thing I picked up is super trendy these days. It is a pair of uh, striped plazo pants and I've seen so many people wear these. Like they're everywhere and when I saw them on Forever 21, I was like, I need to get them. They, again, sadly, do not fit me uh, in the length, so I will have to get them shortened. But they also come with this waistband that you can tie. And I think they will go great with a lot of tops. 
Speaking of jeans, jeans are my weakness. I don't know why I always get a pair of jeans, even though I don't really need jeans. I have way too many jeans to last me a lifetime. But I picked up some jeans anyway. And I picked them up because they were so different. They have this uh, darker colored denim on the side, and that just looks really cool. I think they're very different. They're uh, cool from the back as well. And they fit me, which is great. Next up is Bubs' shirt, but I'm definitely going to be stealing it and it looks like this. It is an ombre uh, flannel and this print is really nice. Also, the fit of the shirt, it's perfect. Love, 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 love it. Do you like it? Yeah, of course. On a scale of 1 to 10, how much do you like it? 10. Really? 10? I like it 11. So I said that this was a summer haul, but I'm going to show you jackets. That is because you can never have too many jackets. Okay, no, I lied. You can because if, if you live where I live, you if you have one jacket, that's too many jackets. But anyway, pick this blush colored jacket up. And this is also Bubs's, but I'm definitely going to be wearing it. And it looks like this. Look at her face. She's like... <laughs> you, you steal my clothes off. I picked this blush colored jacket up. You're looking for cheaper jackets which fit you really nicely i think forever 21 really do some good jackets this item i got is an item which you wear on top of layering pieces and by that i mean i got this khaki colored uh jacket is yes, it a jacket khaki. like what is khaki oh so what is this cargo cargo green no it's just green army green I want it to be some sort of green. Just green sounds boring. Okay, this is an army green color jacket. It's not khaki. And it is super trendy because it has these patches on the side. And uh, this would look great on a plain t-shirt. It would just make an outfit, like a plain basic outfit, so much more interesting. I like it a lot. It's not very, very thick. It's kind of like a denim material. Okay, I think we're done with Forever 21. Next up, let's move on to outfitters. Now, I have spent, I think, the major amount of money at Outfitters because they have so much cute stuff. I sound like such a spoiled lady right now, but I can't help I can't help myself when I go to Outfitters. They have really good clothes. They're currently having a 30% off sale. Not sponsored. I wish it was though. I did get a lot of things. But on the plus side, I got them on a discount. So that's great. The first thing that I got from Outfitters is something really, really different. And I don't know if I would wear it. But, I mean, I'm gonna try my best. It is really, really good for summer because it's so soft, like, but the only problem is, if not styled correctly and worn to the right place, these could look like pajama bottoms. And honestly, I don't want to look like that I'm wearing pajama bottoms outside. But if I can style this, and if I can find a way to style this really nicely, this will be a winner of an outfit. The next thing I picked up from Outfitters are a pair of joggers. Now these are definitely something that have to be styled properly because or else you're going to look like as if you're going to get groceries in your night suit. Do you think it's acceptable to wear joggers just like that? Like apart from wearing it to the airport or wearing it around the house? I think you can wear that when you're just like not feeling it. Yeah, okay, so you can wear this if you are heading out of the house at 2 a.m. Don't do that if you're not allowed to, but yeah, I, I've got these pair of joggers. They're green, they're they're green in color. They fit really nicely um, on the leg. I'm still not sure how I will style these, probably with a white t-shirt. Or will, this go, will these go with a black t-shirt? Hmm. I just know they're going to be super comfortable. That's, that's all I know. The next thing I picked up from Outfitters was this uh, linen cotton t-shirt t-shirt no it's a shirt and I love this shirt as soon as I got this I was like oh my god this is so me I have to get this and when I saw the bag I was like score I need to get this now it smells wonderful because I have worn this out and this fits really well as well super comfortable very good for the summer and it's full sleeves and I like it next up I picked up this shirt this is a plain blue shirt it has a little bit of a stripy pattern like 
white stripes running through the shirt which makes it look really really good you could wear this to uh, the office as well like if you have business casual and I think it's a great shirt that you can dress up and dress down. I love this shirt so much that in the words of popular bloggers, it up in another color. And that is this color. I like this color more because I picked this color up first. It's a blush pink. No, it's not blush. It's like a pastel -y, light pink color. And I've tried the sleeves off. And it's a little wrinkly because obviously I've worn this shirt out. But it's such an effortless piece. This on jeans obviously, but it looks really good. So yeah, really happy with both the colors. They're super soft, really good for the summer. Okay, the next item from Outfitters is this white top. And I got this top thinking to pair it with these pants. So this should be an interesting outfit if I can pull it off. I don't think you can have too many white tops. Right, bubs? Look bubs. We have a problem, clearly. I picked up some more stuff from Outfitters and this is a plain white t-shirt which I got from the men's section. Fiery story, when I was shopping at the men's section, I was going through the shirts because there were so many options and I kept them against myself in the mirror and then the guy comes up to me and he's like, can I help you? Are you looking for something for someone else as a gift? And I'm like, no, I'm, I'm just shopping for myself. Outfitters, if by any chance you come across this video, you should have plain t-shirts for girls as well because they're such a staple. This plain shirt that I got is also from the men's section. It has a distressed neck which is so cool and I love the fit of this shirt. Surprisingly, it fits really really well. And the next shirt is a dark grey one which I have already worn because I couldn't resist. And this one has a pocket in front and the shirt that I'm wearing is very similar to uh, this grey one because this also has a pocket and it's also from the men's section from Outfitters. I picked up some jewellery. The first pair of uh, earrings I picked up, it's not really a pair, it has a lot of pairs but this is the first thing that I picked up and I love the earrings. Uh, they're, they remind me of the Mughal Empire like the Mughal architecture or the other pair that I picked up is a little more fun and not as sophisticated as those ones but I mean they're really fun and they look like this. They have hearts and smiley faces and sunglasses. I really, really like that. Last pair of jewelry I picked up from Outfitters was this necklace, which is so cool. I've already worn this out and I really, really like it. And I think it could, good, it could look good with this t-shirt as well. But what do you think? Okay, now let's move on to Cardi. I only got one thing from Cardi because uh, I already have way too many clothes and this I actually bought to wear on my birthday and it looks like this. This is a plain black frock style shirt. I feel like frock styles are so in these days and I really liked the embroidered pattern on the front. I really like the detailing on the sleeves but they can be such a pain when you're trying to do things like eat. So love the style not really crazy about the practicality of it okay, and the last place that I went to was ethnic I've made it a habit not to go near ethnic because I will buy stuff so I don't go to ethnic anymore but the last time I went to ethnic I picked up this dress and this is such a cute dress I love the embroidered pattern on the dress it has embroidery at the back as well and just the detailing on the shirt is really good and this also smells amazing because I wore it. Before I end this video, I want to let you know that I am collaborating on this video with a fashion vlogger and a YouTuber. Her name is Ikra. She lives in the US and she reached out to me that she wanted to collaborate on Her channel is still very, very young and I remember how much of a pain it was to gain subscribers, especially from 0 to 100. Like the anxiety was real. So it would be great if you could go to her channel. I'm going to leave her channel links down below. Say hi, tell her that, that I sent you there and give her video a like and subscribe if you like. Hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, make sure to give it a big thumbs up. Subscribe to my channel. Make sure you are notified whenever I upload a video. Make sure you click that bell button to get notified if you are not already. I upload every single weekend. Bye! Gotta stop recording. Gotta stop recording!